In this video, we will begin working to identify industry information. Industry information is important for understanding the greater environment in which a business or organization operates. In particular, there are three main components we want to know about a particular industry. The industry classification codes, the industry location, and the industry type and size. The industry classification codes organize industries according to a numbered scheme. The two most common types are NAICS and SIC codes. SIC codes, which stand for Standard Industrial Classification System, were started over 60 years ago. However, they have largely been replaced by the North American Industrial Classification System codes, also known as NAICS codes. NAICS codes were established in the early 1990s partially as a result of the North American Free Trade Agreement. NAICS codes provide more industry specificity compared to SIC codes, thereby being somewhat more valuable. However, many databases still utilize SIC codes, so it is important to know both. Industry location will help with determining geographic trends and other business factors. For example, knowing that there are several major automotive firms in the Detroit area can perhaps tell us about the makeup of Detroit's economy. Industry information can best be found for industries in the United States, although international information is becoming more commonplace. Industry type and size helps us answer questions about the degree of specialization, the market size, and the number of companies that make up the industry. Degree of specialization refers to the scope of the industry's products and services. Market size details the potential number of buyers or sellers within the specific niche of the industry. In general, it is easier to find information regarding a larger industry, for example, steel production, than for a smaller industry like bicycle manufacturing. We will begin by finding the SICK code and NICS code for the Jimmy John's sub sandwich firm. In this video, we will utilize LexisNexis, although numerous other databases, such as Hoover's, also provide for searching based on SIC and NAICS codes. Let's start at the Business Information Services webpage. Hopefully you remember the website link from our last video. In case you don't, please navigate to library.illinois.edu backslash BIS backslash. Once on the site, click on the link that says BIS Databases, which can be found under Articles and Reports. As a side note, our most popular databases can also be found on the left side of the page, listed under Key Databases. BIS has a wonderful listing of databases. For a comprehensive list, please click on BIS Databases. Once we click on BIS Databases, we can go to the alphabetical list of databases in the top center of the screen and navigate to LexisNexis Academic Universe. In our next video, we will explore how to find the SICK and NAICS codes within LexisNexis and then building a company list. If you have any further questions, please contact the Business Information Services team.